New York property heir Robert Durst has been hospitalized with COVID-19 days after being sentenced to life in jail for the murder of his best friend. The multimillionaire, subject of the crime documentary series The Jinx, is on a ventilator after testing positive his lawyer Dick DeGaron told the Los Angeles Times, Durst, 78, was sentenced to life behind bars without parole on Thursday for the murder of Susan Berman in 2000. A statement from the Los Angeles Superior Court indicated it had been notified on Friday night someone at the hearing on Thursday had now tested positive for COVID-19. As a result, the court will follow CDC and LA County Department of Public Health guidelines for assessing close contacts of the end. There were no additional reports of COVID infections related to this case, it added. Durst, who attended the sentencing hearing in a wheelchair, has a number of reported medical issues including bladder cancer. Mr. Daguerrean told the LA Times he was very, very sick in the courtroom, and looked worse than I've ever seen him. Durst is the estranged son of New York property magnate Seymour Durst and elder brother of Douglas, who heads the Durst organization. Last month a jury found Robert Durst guilty of shooting Susan Berman in the back of the head at her Beverly Hills home in 2000. She had been his confidant and evidence from the trial indicated she had helped provide Durst with a false alibi in the earlier disappearance of his ex-wife Kathleen McCormack. Prosecutors described him as narcissistic psychopath and alleged that Durst killed Berman because he feared she would reveal what she knew to authorities about Ms. McCormack's disappearance in New York in 1982. They also claimed in court he was responsible for the killings of his former wife Ms. McCormack and an elderly neighbor Morris Black.